What is this? TAC 1421 is playing Hunger Games? Uh, that is correct. And I wanted to start out by saying that uh, the Hunger Games, MCPP, whatever you want to call it, hardcore games, not that they call it, it really isn't what it used to be, but I decided, you know what, I'll play a few games just for old time's sakes. And I tried to go Stomper and a bunch of other kits, uh, but this very first game that I recorded, I was going to go Kangaroo. And I picked Kangaroo, and then I was like, okay, now what? Because uh, I've never played with this new you know, system where you pick your kit. So I was like trying to figure out what to do. And I, I finally figured out the next game that you actually have to click that little fire thing at the very far right to actually pick the kit. Uh, they should have made that more obvious, but uh, so I'm going no kit in this game because I didn't know how to pick my kit. Um, but overall, I think I really actually kind of like that little system that they have there because you kind of get to see little icons of all your kits that you own. And you kind of, I think it's a better way of trying to see what kit you want to play. Uh, if you have like a visual kind of repre representation of what you may want to go. So that's my little thoughts on that. I think it's a pretty cool system, but I, I definitely think they should have made it a little bit easier for people that either A, haven't played before, or B, haven't seen that system before in place. Make it easier for those people to uh, get a kind of a, a glimpse of what's going on and how to easily uh, pick their kit. But anyways, this game was uh, pretty short. Uh, we didn't start with a whole lot of players. I think we started around like 50-ish or something like that, which is, you know, not too many, not, you know, not a whole... Um, it's, it's still a good amount of people, let's just put it that way. Um, and I right away went after this team of two here, and it looks like there's maybe 30, there's 38 players, or 39 players to start with, it looks like. But anyways, enough about that. So I go after these two players and I uh, get a quick little double kill. They didn't really have anything, so that's, you know, nice little kill there. But today I just want to talk about kind of, you know, MCPVP in general and how it's really not what it used to be. And before, when I started about, I don't know, two years ago now, I think, maybe, close to two years, uh, it's approaching two years when I first started playing, or back in the day, and, you know, there was maybe like ten kits, and there was like two kits for free, I know you could play like a Barbarian, and, and what was, uh, I forget the name of it now, but... It was where it gave you a spe speed potion. I forget the name. My apologies. But there's only like two kits for free. And then there's like maybe a few other kits that you can get. And Barbarian back then was you just got a, a sword, a uh, stone sword. And, you know, it was really fun. You know, it wasn't, you know, there wasn't really, there wasn't too much like kind of mechanics or things to really know about the game. Uh, which was what I liked. You know, you could easily pick it up and play. Now, nowadays, I feel like you can't really just go into a game and say, hey, I want to play this hardcore games and I want to, you know, start playing this and really, you know, enjoy it and don't really need any kind of prior knowledge besides maybe knowledge of Minecraft. Uh, but I understand that in all games and in life, pretty much, whatever you're going to play, uh, you kind of need to practice at it, but uh, there's also kind of a, a, a level where you are able to just pick it up and play. And I feel like this is one of those games where you should really be able to just pick it up and play. There's, I don't know how many kits there are now, and it's just kind of, kind of ridiculous. And I feel like it's not really the type of game that you can just kind of pick up and play. You really have to practice. And before, in the old days... You used to just be able to, you know, have fun and basically just use whatever kit you want. There was some replayability because there's maybe like, you know, they got up to like 25 kits and you maybe own maybe, you know, 5 to 10 plus the free ones. And then you could pretty much, you know, do whatever you want and enjoy it. Uh, but now it's just like, okay, there's so many kits I'm never going to really be able to memorize all the kits and what they do and what counters what and what happens when you do this and da 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 and so you can only really play a certain amount of kits and when you kind of approach a kit that you've never seen before you don't know how to counter it or you don't know what to do and I feel like it's more of not necessarily strategy but how you good you are at PvP which I don't like and I know a lot of people do like that uh, but I don't like that and you know in, in the regular Hunger Games uh, you the whole point of it was to kind of have both strategy and strength and all that kind of stuff. 
Uh, most of the time, the people that actually won the Hunger Games weren't necessarily the strongest and you know most brutal ones. There's also people that kind of had like traps and stuff. If you've ever seen the actual movies and stuff like that, um, and that's what I kind of liked. I, what I liked about it in the uh, old days was. You know, it was kind of a combination of the two. You had to outsmart your opponent, and you also had to kind of go in with a better strategy than them. Um, and also, you know, the, the PvP issue was also kind of a minor little little thing. But now it's pure just how good are you at PvP, which is, is I just don't like that. And that's kind of what set me off and why I don't really play, because it's, it's tough. I, I don't get the mechanics down too well. I'm not really good at the mechanics at all. Uh, you'll notice that I'm I'm really bad at fighting, and I, I'm gonna go out and just say that. I know most people already know that, but I, I'm really terrible at fighting and and Minecraft, and so it's it's just tough for me to battle people. But um, you know, it is what it is. I I might play this a little bit here and there, and you, you'll probably see videos every once in a while from my channel uh, just to kind of go back. But uh, this was a quick little game. I, I do hope you enjoyed it. I got two kills. And it probably should have counted as more. I don't know how I didn't get at least three. Um, I thought I had four, but I guess it didn't really count the one where it fell. he fell from the tower. But whatever, it is what it is. And yeah, so I got 16th place. Didn't have a kit. Almost lasted 10 minutes, close to 10 minutes there. And that's going to be that. The guy that killed me actually got in ninth place. He was a cannibal. And he didn't actually end up winning, which makes me sad. Because I always like to see the people that kill me actually end up winning the game. But yeah, that's that. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see everyone next time. Peace.